Howdy folks, welcome back to my channel. I've got a fun video for you today. Here on my lap is the $104 box Tampura that I did a video about recently. And um, thank you for all the likes and comments on that video. It was actually quite popular. I wasn't sure how it would go over, but it was actually quite popular. And you remember in that video, I mentioned that the build quality on this instrument was not the greatest, and I realize it's, you know, it's very inexpensive, but uh, one of the things that I noted was that there's a bent tuner, and you can see that there, that one of these tuners is quite bent. And the other thing that I mentioned was when you flip it over, they actually installed the tuners reversed of what's traditional. Typically, you put the gear towards the bridge, not the gear towards the headstock, and so they're all sort of inverted of the normal method that most people install tuners, so I'm going to fix that too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these tuners out, I'm going to fill the holes that are there with uh, toothpicks, just a cool little trick to kind of fill those holes in, and then I'm going to install some new tuners. Now, I got a set of these here, and I always have these on hand. These are what they call the um, Open Gear Economy Tuners from CB Giddy. You can get those at cbgiddy.com. And these are like seven, eight dollars a set for a set of six. And I use these a lot because they're actually quite high quality. I mean, they're not the highest quality tuners, but for the price, they are very acceptable. Uh, I've used these on a lot of my projects. So I will be replacing the ones that are in here with this. And while I have the strings off to do that, I um, am also going to add some decoration. So I picked up a couple of uh, die cut decals here that have kind of a, a uh, Eastern kind of theme to them. And I'm gonna go ahead and put those on the tampura as well, just to dress it up a little. Um, and normally when I do a, a modding video like this, I usually make the instrument electric at the same time. Uh, if you saw shortly after I did this unboxing, I did a video where I had used this with other instruments and I actually amplified it using my Cortado here from Zeppelin Design Labs, which I also did a video about and it worked beautifully. And in fact, it worked so beautifully that I'm not even gonna bother to try to uh, cut this open and put a pickup in it. I'm just gonna use this from now on. It really, really worked well for that purpose. So that's the goal today. Replace these tuners, dress it up a little, and uh, we'll see what this baby sounds like after I'm done. It's actually fairly in tune. I haven't tuned it for a couple days, so that's actually impressive. Um, but anyway, uh, it, I had mentioned also in the unboxing video that, um, you could probably easily make one of these. I will use my caliper and measure these strings and uh, put those uh, values on the screen so if you're interested, you know what strings are on it. And by the way, they do just look like round wound, like acoustic guitar strings, nothing special there. So anyway, let's mod this thing. So there you have it, folks. That was taking this here uh, $104 tempura, uh, replacing the tuners and uh, putting a couple decals on there. Now, if you didn't get a good look at that one during the video there, it says namaste, y'all. Uh, namaste, it, it comes from a Sanskrit word. I'm not the expert on on uh, Hindi and all that culture and stuff, but uh, it, it's basically a greeting or like kind of a wishing of goodwill. And I thought that was kind of cute to add it to the y'all, you know, just kind of a, a merging of... Uh, of uh, Southern culture and, and uh, Eastern culture, I guess. Uh, and that just kind of pulls it together. This here uh, uh, design is called the Hamsa or the Hamsa. And it's got the eye and the hand integrated. And I thought that was perfect because that's right about where you would pluck the strings. So anyway, uh, another look at the tuners here. I think the pearl uh, kind of buttons on the tuners actually look really nice with this uh, getup. 
and then on the back, um, now they are oriented correctly. Now, if I really was going to be, um, you know, kind of particular about it, I could go back and touch up those toothpicks with a spot of stain. But uh, as I mentioned before, there's already a lot of dings and scratches in this finish. I'm not going to get too uh, sentimental about those uh, little little dots you can see on the back side. But overall, I think it's a big improvement, and I really do like this here tempura. And you know, so I've got what $104 in the tempura and about seven bucks in the tuners. I mean, so for around 110, you've got a pretty. Uh, Cool instrument that doesn't really sound like anything else. So there you go. If you like what I do on this channel, please hit that subscribe button below. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up for me. See you guys soon.